Yo, peace and prosper. Peace and prosper, yo. No, I was sending love out to people. I was like just, I was splitting the love between me and them. I was like halving it and sending half to the, everyone around me and half to me. Um, yeah. So, what's been going on with me inside? Um, I... I wanted so hard for nothing to mean anything to be totally free to think whatever I want because when I think something, um, it's it's like internal. Um, <clears throat> something reminds me of someone at uni said internal to me. Um, don't know what it meant. <sighs> yeah. Um, so what's been going on with me? Well, I lost the plot. I, um, I got angry because I was on my period. Um, and I'm grateful for that experience. Um, It kind of helped, to be honest, um, and I kind of air towards thinking that um, sort of lean towards thinking that PMS is actually a good thing. Um, women need to have a day of being this way because we're so we're so giving you know we've got breasts um this is what um bridget nielsen said we've got breasts and um we give 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 you know we give emotionally all the time we give um this is why i'm splitting my 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 love i'm loving i'm splitting my love in half and i'm sending half out to everybody and i'm sending half to myself and like i'm balancing like it's, it's sort of like having boundaries on balancing like it 50 50 between uh, who say say i'm like um holding someone in my mind and i'm balancing half my energy between them and me you know um yeah in terms of like a boundary you know um i'm not going to give you all of me you know i'm giving you half sort of thing, um, is what, what I did, um, just went to Morrison's and that's what I did, um, yeah, so, I got angry and I ended up having the best day ever, um, and I figured that anger is okay because, um, I, I could say it like, I was on the bus, right? And um, I says like, oh, you've been so unfair. They, they were like, this this was on my period as well. Um, I felt like they were all like pressuring me really hard. And I, you know, I just said so. I says, I think it's because I'm trans. I think it's because you're being unfair because I'm trans and you're pressuring me really hard. And um, the driver of the bus said, you know, it's a good job you said that because people really, really were giving it Hard is not the word. I mean, this was like mega hard, Gi giving me pressure like mega hard, you know, um, and we're being um, rude. We're being rude. Um, they were coming on to me, to be honest. They were saying, you need to do someone right now sort of thing. And um, yeah. Anyways, it's the same thing. It's the same thing on my period yesterday. Same thing on my period. Um, I don't know. That's how it felt. That's how it felt, and I like I spoke it. I spoke it. You know, I did actually shout. I shouted it on the way to Mum's in the morning, and I spoke it on the way back. Um. I mean, all of this started when I watched Walking Dead. I just, I just, I just went, you know, I just, I was gone, you know, when I saw that violence and, um, 
I, a big part of it was I've been trying to do that to myself. What that violence did to me, I've been trying to do that to myself. You know, going places in my mind that would like do that to me. Um, knowing that it's okay, that to experience that is okay. Um, yeah. So, I mean, I, I mean, leap. I mean, leaving it aside, um, whether whether people are pressuring me or whether that's just the way I see it. Um, it you see, because if if I if I see it that way, that puts me in an anxiety that causes the danger that I'm seeing to to become real. If I'm seeing it that way, even though it's not that way, and it makes perfect sense, and that's that's PMS pretty much explained. Um, it puts. It puts me in the very danger that I'm scared, the, the danger that's not real, that I'm so freaking scared of. You know, it actually makes that danger real. Um, chronic anxiety, you know, major, major, major anxiety um, brings that, that fear to become real. And I suppose it's a good way of explaining how, like, what a per person focus on becomes real, you know. Um, if I worry about a certain thing happening a lot, you know, it be makes that thing more likely to happen, you know. Um, yeah. Makes that thing more likely to happen. So that that's all I got, really, to be honest. Um, so um, I'm going to leave it here and goodbye. Have a good one.